Hey guys, got another deck profile for you. This is my Rank Up Magic ABC Dragon Buster deck. Um, I kind of put this together because I have been trying to have a Rank Up Magic Utopia deck for forever, but it just didn't really work out. And then I thought, hey, ABC Dragons. Um, it's a great engine. It just churns out fours. Plus, I've got Dragon Buster, so really all I needed to do was add rank up magic spells to it and then put utopia stuff in the extra deck um so i think it's a lot of fun i can get out some great boards um and it's a good deck um well without further ado let's get underway um first of all you're gonna play the abc monsters a assault core b buster drake and C Crush Wyvern all at three because that's how the deck works. Uh, pretty self explanatory. Um, if you know anything about ABCs, um, this is this all is should be pretty standard um, for the most part. Um, three gold gadget, three silver gadget to special summon your uh, pieces or each other. Um, play three photon thrasher. Um, for the light level 4 special summon um, for Tsukuyomi. Uh, two summoner monk because I have a lot of spells. And last monsters, I play three galaxy soldier. Um, one to put pieces in the graveyard, two because um, I re really like um, uh, Cyber Dragon Infinity. So I'm kind of putting this in any deck that I can just because I love it. Um, so that's just my preference. You don't need to have that if you don't want to or don't have it. Um, on to spells. We're going to play three Union Hanger and three Terraforming. Try and get that Union Hanger into your hand as fast as possible. Uh, I'm going to play three Rank Up Magic Baryon's Force and one uh, rank up magic limited variance force um i i like this card this is this is how you get out your uh zexal and uh silent honor dark um because i like to play that for fun because i i always wanted to use dark but i never really had a deck that i could really actually use it in ex well except for my my uh uh rank for shark deck which I kind of recently made, but yeah, so I, I really wanted to use it, so that's why um, that's in there. Play one Soul Charge, two Twin Twister for a Spell and Trap removal, and if you don't need one of the Rank Up Magics in your hand, you can discard it with this, um, or you could also discard pieces um, to make Buster Dragon. Uh, on Traps, you play Solemn Warning, Solemn Strike, and then these last two are just ones that I kind of just want to play. Um, one Fiendish Chain, uh, because it's Fiendish Chain, and then one Magic Cylinder, because I think it's funny to see my opponent kill themselves. That about sums up why I love Magic Cylinder so much. Um, and that's the deck, 40 cards. Um, yeah. Uh, extra deck, three ABC Dragon Buster. It's one of your main boss monsters this deck has a has a several boss monsters um that's like probably the the main one out of all of the other ones i'm gonna play uh one bujinte tsukiyomi to help get out dragon buster one gear 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 gigant x um to help search whatever you monsters you need um and one digusto emerald those are all standard in any ABC Dragon deck. And then for the other Rank Up Magic stuff, I've got um, two number 39 Utopia. I have one Utopia Ray, which you could also use um, Utopia Prime instead. All I use it for is just another material on my Zexal. Um, play one Utopia the Lightning. And one Utopic Zexal, which will prevent your opponent from doing 
almost literally anything um, on their turn just by detaching material during your opponent's turn. Um, so you want to get as many materials as you can on this. Just a note, um, I had forgotten this the first time I brought this out in this deck because I just don't use it. I haven't used it as very often in other decks, really. So um, I, I am familiar with it now. Um, but you can't use um, Utopia the Lightning as material for it. Um, it does say that in the card text um, that it can't be used as XYZ material, so just a thing not to forget because that would be like a game loss if you try to do that in a tournament and somebody catches you, um, even if it's by accident. Just keep that in mind. Um, I play one Silent Honor Arc and Silent Honor Dark. Um, this is just a really fun thing to do, uh, to play Silent Honor Arc, steal an opponent's monster, use a rank up magic into Honor Dark, steal another monster, and then attack directly. Um, that's just a really fun thing to do, plus it uh, revives itself if it's destroyed as long as it's got Honor Arc as a material and it um, would be in the graveyard. So it just revives itself over and over again. Um, I just that's I just really like this card. That's kind of why I play it instead of playing something else. You don't have to play this if you don't want to. And the same goes with the last two of my extra deck. Uh, Cyber Dragon Nova and Cyber Dragon Infinity. Um, if you don't want to play like the Galaxy Soldiers or these two, you could just substitute them with like whatever you want, really. You could play Abyss Dweller, you could play Castell, you could play Tornado Dragon, or uh, and then a Utopia Prime if you want another unit on to your um, Lightning, or just whatever else you want to do. Um, just these are good alternatives. It's just you know I just have the other ones in there because I think they're they're fun. Um, but if you're playing to win, definitely play play uh, these instead because these are like definitely better. If you're playing uh, the deck strictly competitively, this is more of a competitive uh, slash fun casual mix. Um, it's actually, I wouldn't really call ABCs casual, but yeah, you know what I mean. Um, so that concludes my deck profile. I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, cool. I think that might be a new record. Seven minutes. Um, yeah, so I kept it nice and short. Um, and to the point. Um, hope you guys enjoy. Uh, stay tuned for the next video.